Today I'm going to show you how to replace blank va values that are showing on your um, card visuals and uh, multi-row card visuals with a zero value, uh, if that's uh, your uh, goal on your visuals. So the problem statement. So I've got a data model with two tables, uh, financials, fact table, and dates, uh, dimension tables. And um, I've got uh, um, the relationship created by date here. Um, now, the blank values are showing when you select a year, for example, in that case, that doesn't exist in your fact table financials, OK? So what I mean by that is um, in my dates uh, table, I've got 2015 here. But if I look at financials table, I've only got data for 2013 and 2014. Um, hence, when I select 2013 or 2014 on the slicer, I'm able to view what total sales are. Um, by the way, it's a simple measure that I've got here. It's uh, total sales, um, sum of sales. But when I select 2015, which is coming from my dates table here, it doesn't exist in financials table. So hence, um, it showed me a blank value. So I want to change this behavior. So then when I select 2015 or any other year that is not in my financials table, it would show me zero values instead of blank. OK, so how do you do that? It's very simple. Um, let me copy this. measure. Now I'm just going to create another measure here. I'm going to just change the name, uh, show zero instead of blank. And now I'm just going to add at the end of my uh, ducks formula here is zero. So it doesn't matter what my result is in here, even if in that um, rows do not exist, it would always add zero at the end. Hence, let's bring it over here and then replace my total sales with uh, Total sales show zero instead of blank. That's how it would work. And the same for um, the card visual. So if I bring it over here and replace my measure with a new measure, here you go. 